Hi guys, welcome to the video for Scorpio for the next 48. I hope you're doing fantastic. Let's go ahead and see what is happening here for Scorpio. Messages for Scorpio. For the next couple of days. Messages for Scorpio. Blessed. Wow, okay. 22, master number, um, it means harmony, things coming into balance for yourself. Very blessed. Okay, good card. A lot of blessings coming in around you. Okay, so let's see what the tarot cards have to say for the next 48 or so for Scorpio. Messages for Scorpio. The Two of Air. Mentally conflicted, needing to make a choice. Going back and forth in your mind over something. Messenger of Fire. Could be an air or a fire sign around you. Could also be an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You get new information with the ace of air new communication you could also have new ideas and you got an idea and you're trying to make a decision based on the idea and the messenger of fire can also be moving like travel five of water something here kind of was disappointing you making you feel sad you could have a sense of loss surrounding a situation um, it's just it feels um, with the aid of air you're giving this situation a lot of mental thought like you're it's a lot of mental activity you could be thinking of a strategy a way to become more independent or something nine of wands fire energy here that won't give up it's somebody who won't quit. Your energy is judgment. So you have a calling or a decision to make. Very big decision. Judgment is about a transformation or you want change in your life in some way. Okay, there's a king of wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius around you. Fire sign. We have information that comes in fast. So it could be phone, text, email, anything, but it feels like it's rushed. What is the outcome? Six of air. Things are going to become easier. You're coming out of a situation there where there may have been conflict. You could be blocking a person too if the information that they're bringing you is too stressful. You kind of like avoid contact with them to have mental peace. So it's kind of like anytime you talk to a certain person, you could even feel guilty. Five of water can be guilt, remorse, a sense of sadness. Um you're very blessed though so the judgment it could be something that is coming back around again from your past the judgment is something that's resurrected a spiritual transformation or a change so what is the nine of wands coming into the future it's fire sign energy it's somebody that is not giving up the sun card it could be a leo it could also be something that makes you feel very happy. 
The sun represents happiness, optimism, positivity, growth. What is the eight of air here? Okay, once again, you're, there's a conflict because something stirred your passion and woke you up a little bit and made you realize like, okay, I need to make a decision. What is the ace of air for Scorpio? Two of wands is like a crossroads, but it's a good crossroads. Three of swords, whatever it was that was hurtful or painful or you felt separated from a person because of words, um, you're coming up as judgment. So it's like you're the one with the judgment. You need to make um, a stand with the seven of wands. This is like you have to take a stand. You have to stand your ground. Perhaps you have to tell someone to mind their own business even. Um, what is the sun representing? What is the sun representing? Okay, eight of water. So you're either walking away or walking towards this energy. Um, now, what is the six of air? The nine of earth. This is an earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. It's also about independence, financial independence or being single, being on your own. What is the King of Fire about? The Four of Wands. Taking a vacation, spending time. This is the stable situation. Um, there per could be a person with fire in their chart who has a lot of passion. Could be an artist. What is Eight of Water? I think you walk away from the situation. There's a Three of somebody wants to have a reunion they want to get together maybe even just like something very light or social six of earth somebody's trying to get you to go out with them I feel and you're conflicted um, what is six of air and nine of coin okay there's a ten of water you have total emotional fulfillment and great happiness um, so either you're leaving your current situation or you're already happy in your current situation. This is possibly five of cups. Could be sadness from the past. Oh no, you're getting nine of water. The wish comes true. Wish is fulfilled with the ten. So you're having to make a very big judgment call and be brave and stand up for yourself in some way. And you have to sort of stand up for your independence. Um, now you're either leaving a situation because of heartbreak and pain, or you are staying away from a person. Nine of Cups and Ten of Cups is a lot of happiness. What is Three of Air? What is Three of Air? Okay, Three of Wands. There could be somebody here that you're avoiding. It could be a fire sign, like they're wanting to hear from you or talk to you. What is three of wands? Wow. We have a queen of earth, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, and we have the death card. A change, a major change or a major transformation. We have the temptation card on the bottom, which could be Capricorn and a queen of water. Temptation can also be a toxic situation. It's the devil. We have the hermit, which represents Virgo, and then we have a nine of air. There's a lot of stress or worry. Five of pentacles, feeling left out in the cold, ten of swords, having a lot of mental stress. Excuse me, stop that. Sorry. Okay, so you are blessed. I feel like either there's a blessing coming in excuse me or you already have a blessing in your life and this is just like a reminder like how good things are actually 
going for yourself. Um, because your environment is pretty good. Four of Wands, it's stable. There's a passionate person there. It's almost like there's a person that's coming in. They want to connect with you and you're not sure. You're kind of avoiding them, perhaps. There's a change in your circumstances, though. Um, you can make the change if you want to. So I'm going to leave this here. Thank you for tuning in and take care.